important is it for you to sort of separate yourselves from, from who those characters were when you start to dive into a new project? I'm not a superhero? Yeah. No, I mean, I no, 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 that's a question. I, I like to think I'm a superhero, no? <laughs> <laughs> um, um, I, I think that if someone's a true fan and they want to see you, you know, do whatever chapter comes next in your life, and I've been really fortunate that I think the fans are excited. I think they want to see what Jennifer's going to do. I think they want. I think. I think that's mm -hmm. exciting. I know as fans, as everyone, you like to see yeah. what other people do. Yeah, it's nice to. I mean, I think as an actor, it's just nice to look for something different. You know, mm -hmm. it's just. It was wonderful playing Cameron on House for all those years, and amazing writing and an incredible cast, and it was fabulous. I have no complaints, but it was. It was also exciting to like be let free and, and to play new characters and to try something new. And part of the appeal of Once Upon a Time for me was that it was totally character driven. Mm -hmm. it, it wasn't procedural. You know, I've been saying medical terms. I was going to ask what's part of medical oh. terms or fantasy terms. <laughs> medical terms. That's hot. If I never have to say medical terms ever again, I'd be What's hot of the hours or the problem. medical terms? Yeah. <laughs> three in the morning saying medical terms. <laughs> Um, you know, are I'm, you a doctor now? Uh, I'm pretty much <laughs> qualified. I, like, I, I actually, I had a cyst that burst years ago, and I was sure that I knew what it was, like based on. Like, you know, my appendix is on the right, and it's the pain is on the left, and, it, and the, the amount of pain that I'm having, and the color to my skin. So literally, like, I'm in the hospital. I'm like, so here's the thing. I'm pretty sure I have a cyst. I think I'm a doctor from Washington. Why is that weird? And I just have like, these doctors staring at me, like, what? I'm like, and I'm like, I'm afraid it's referred pain because I know that if it's my appendix and it's a referred pain I'm going to make sure that's not the case. And they're like, and they did all the tests they're like, well, you were right. No way. <laughs> I love that. I would hate that though, like playing a doctor, like if you're on an airplane and something yeah. happens, and they're like, no, no, and you're like, not really. Yeah. Yeah. Although, didn't like the cast on ER say that they, they, they've actually, like, their stories, I think, about yeah, some of them having gone stories. through mm -hmm. emergencies with people and known what to do because, oh yeah. because well, and the training yeah. is correct, because oh, you have experts on that, so. You yeah, do, you have nurses, correct. you have real people showing you how to bandage and stuff. Mm -hmm. and yeah. Well, you do, I mean, there's certain <laughs> things that come up enough <laughs> times that, especially if you have someone guiding you through it, you start to go, okay. <laughs> you know, it's like I could probably intubate someone, hopefully. Uh, if I was on a stranded island and had something sharp, I could probably do a tracheotomy. That's the only thing I could probably do. But um, but those would be like what I do.